Oh. Right, so after my last video when I posted me melting all the poop using the little oven in my room, I had this comment. And ever since that video, I couldn't stop thinking about it on whether that actually works. So welcome to my kitchen. Probably won't be many videos taking place here, but we've got saucepan. And after so many comments, I've got myself a proper mask with the proper filters, proper eyewear, massive box of poop again. And I think that's everything I'm gonna need to test whether this actually works. My prediction is everything just goes to brown. Is that what happens when you mix every single color? I'm, I'm not really sure what else could happen. You're putting everything in here, it's gonna all mix into one color. We'll have a look. We got a camera angle here and here. Let's see how it goes. I didn't really think about the audio too much when I was doing this, so there's probably gonna be a lot of voiceover. That, that's just the way it's gonna have to be, otherwise I'm gonna sound like Bane for the rest of the video. We're gonna start off with a skull mold, I think. Let's just see whether this works first, and then we can move on to other things. Okay. We're getting liquid. It is liquid plastic. Okay, so I burnt myself a little bit, but it wasn't bad. I put way more in this time. We'll keep an eye on it and hopefully we can get something good out of this. It is working a lot faster. I've only been recording for 13 minutes so far. It's, it's going better than last time. It's just turning into a brown sludgy mess. Okay, you can see the state of my kitchen and how smoky it is. Do not do this at home. Don't do this at all. This is not the way to do it. Okay. Okay, so you can... You can kind of see it. Like, it looks okay at the bottom, but I didn't melt that one as much. This hasn't gone well. It looks horrendous. My kitchen is smoky. I've, I've got a fan. 
I've got this Dyson fan blowing, a uh, shark fan, my bad Dyson. The window's open. We're gonna let this cool down and see how it goes. My fiance comes home in like five minutes. She knew that I was doing this, but she's not gonna be happy. I didn't get much plastic on the hob, it, barely anything. But it does stink. I, I need to get out of here. No animals are in here, doors closed, windows open, everything like that. Don't do this, this isn't. The, the oven in my office was a better idea than this. We'll come back in an hour and I'll show you this, but I think it's just gonna be a brown blob. We'll see how it goes, I'm burned. Not the way to do it. Okay, so it's actually been a couple of days. Uh, it took a full 24 hours for that plastic smell to get out of our kitchen. I wouldn't recommend doing this. We're gonna open this. I've got a camera angle here too, so you'll be able to see it well. I don't know whether I'll be doing this again. I don't think inside your house there's a good way to recycle all of your poop. I could try shredding it. I think that would make it go faster if I got like a better oven maybe. But I don't think it's for me. I still think I'm gonna go with the heat gun route. It takes a while, maybe it's not worth it, but at least you get to do something with your plastic. Let's crack this open and we'll see what it looks like, see if it looks like the brown blob that I thought it would be. So here it is. It's it's gross looking. It feels gross. It feels like see the texture there. It feels like a hard candy that could just dissolve in water. Obviously this is blobbed up where it's just gone over the sides, but that could probably be broken off. It definitely doesn't look as appealing as my other one. I mean this part's kind of cool. If we could replicate this somehow, that would be worth it, I think. You can just see it looks awful. If I can show you how. It actually looks smoother in the camera than it does in person. It's, it's not great. And obviously the bottom's horrendous. I didn't even try to flatten that in any way. It was just too messy. I knew this wouldn't be great. So obviously you know I'm willing to try dumb things, don't do any of the things that I do. But if you have any ideas of how I could improve this, how it could be a little bit better, I'm willing to buy other stuff. If I have to buy a blender, if you guys really do think the blender method would be better and then pop it into a pan, I've thrown the other pan away so I'd have to buy another one. But any of you guys have any ideas of how I could recycle my poop that doesn't involve spending an hour with a heat gun or hour and a half with a mini oven, something that's actually efficient, something that melts the plastic really well but doesn't turn it into brown actually keeps the separate colors sort of similar to the top here then let me know i am determined to find a way to recycle all of the poop that we produce here i still don't throw any of it away i've still kept it all i just need to find a good way to recycle it let me know down in the comments what you've had success with any ideas you've had or anything else that you've seen i've got links in the description that you can support me on patreon we've got a couple of cool items coming up but Either way, you get the videos early, ad-free. I did promise last week that this week would be the review of the Everyone X400. I still need more time with it. It will be next week. We're so close. I've almost tested everything I wanted to test. It's going to be a good video. I'm excited to tell you about it. Be sure to subscribe if you like this style of content. Give me any ideas you have. Willing to test them all. Thanks for watching. See you next week.